Y'all know remember this beat from AZ Popping collars through the bay in your city If you know, you know You know, you know We try to holler You ended up getting acquitted for the yes, shooting. Sir. Okay. Yeah. And then you did a few months, you said? And no, then, no, and then got released. I bailed out. You bailed out. That one. I bailed okay. out on that one. So I was fighting that from the outside. And then after I got acquitted, I went home a year later, 2006, Christmas time. I was having my kids, all my kids. I have six children with three different women. And, um, I was finally having them all together in in San Francisco. So me being the, you know, some more this, they call it Muri Mangeso, the mm. itchy butt. Mm. Muri Mangeso. I'm like, man, I I got I need to get some more money. You know, I need to get some more money real quick so I can make this Christmas the best Christmas that they ever had. You know what I mean? So I set it up, you know, same thing. It's supposed to be easy. Went out there. But my boy, my the person I usually do business with, he was in the Philippines, you know. So there I go on the flute. I'm like, man, oh, put me on. I'm like, all right, so, bro. This serious, some real, some real life, real life stuff right here, man. This ain't no put me on and just ah, I'll just play. no some real life stuff. Oh man, um, I know. I said, oh, all right. You ain't going to know till you know. <laughs> yeah. And what happened? They didn't know. <laughs> right, right. Wasn't ready. Wasn't ready, man. Yeah. So, and I went down for that, you know? Mm-hmm. And I was like, damn. Did you you Three get days. caught going to Hawaii with some drugs? No, nah, no. Nah, I sent it out there, man. Uh... The whole new, it's just, I got caught with the money and my last of the, the little bit I had of, of mm-hmm. what I had, you know what mm-hmm. I mean? So yeah. he, it was like he called me up. Uh, it's four thirty in the morning, mind you, out there in Hawaii. I was like, man, why are you calling me so late? He was like, oh, I just got out the pipeline, and that's the time the clubs get out out there, like four mm-hmm. thirty, and then they go out to the uh after hour spot about five to eight in the morning. It's it's like Vegas, you know, just all around party. You know what I mean? So I'm like, okay, you got that. He asked me if I was in the hotel. I said, nah. So I told my, my manager at the time, this Korean dude, I said, hey man, can you give him the, um, the address where we at? Uh, you know, I, I don't like, I don't even know where I, how to tell him. So he tells him, 45 minutes later, he says, it's downstairs. I send my manager down there with a bag, just a paper bag with a big peel cap full with the re- remainder of what I had. And he's supposed to get some bread. 45 minutes later, the IRS, the FBI, Secret Service, Hawaii 5 they all, the ATF, they all ram the of uh, the little studio that I was at. And I'm like, man, it's like, who y'all looking for? I mean, it's just me. <laughs> they came deep, man. Mm. So I, they took me straight from there to court, not me to the, uh, to the police station. I went straight mm. to the federal court to see a magistrate. Damn. Magistrate. Yeah. So they already had everything in place for me. Like, oh yeah, well, after this boy, he going straight to court. I'm like, yeah. man. And then after I, my first um scene, I couldn't even get a lawyer. I was trying to get my lawyer. And then um he came on the next court date. Mm-hmm. So something went through. They didn't, my family didn't um give him his retainer. He had to drop out. So that just longered my my stay in Hawaii. And once I got a, a, a court appointed, I said, man, just give me what they're giving me, the best, whatever they give me, man, let me go. Mm-hmm. I'm, I really want to go get to the pen, you know what I mean? Just let me go. So once that happened, I, I shipped off, went to Lompoc. Mm. Lompoc, USP. Doug said it's the FCI now. Okay. But man, you know it's real when you got you got to be suited and booted at four forty five yeah. in the morning, and I didn't know none of this. You know what I'm saying? I've never did. Only did county time. County time. That's it. Most two months. That's it. 
I didn't know what prison, like the, what the homies was telling me did not match up to what I was actually going through. Like it was real, like prison would do two things, either make you a better man or better crook. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And it stopped for me. It scared me straight. What are you trying to hide love?